Hello and welcome to Tablet Guide. Today we're going to be looking at another Huion tablet, the Canvas 16 2021 version pen tablet. Opening the box, you're presented with the usual suspects, the tablet, the stand, the pen, pen holder, which contains 10 replaceable nibs and the pen nib clip for removing the old nibs. Try saying that fast. Three in one cable, USB extension cable, USB-C cable, power cable, power adapter, warranty card, quick start guide, cleaning cloth, and the drawing glove. The stand is fully adjustable. By using either of the two metal supports, you can vary the height of the tablet to best suit your drawing needs. It's also got a small flap at the bottom to stop the tablet sliding onto your lap from the table. A nice idea. This is a 16 inch tablet with 10 shortcut keys down the left side. On the right are the two USB-C ports for connecting to your laptop or PC. The bottom of the pen has a small rubber grip and feels really nice to hold. Need a new pen nib? Look inside the pen holder, there's 10 in there. The driver software comes in four easily navigatable sections. Press keys, digital pen, work area and the about section. It's here you can change things like pen pressure, map the tablet to your monitor and change any other work area settings as you need. To keep things moving, we're going to speed up this part of the video, so do not adjust your sets. I don't normally draw this fast unless I've got a pressing deadline or the pubs are about to shut. Both the pen and the tablet itself are really well made and are of good build quality, just what you'd expect from Huion. I don't often use the shortcut keys myself, but they do come in handy for zooming in and out of the canvas and for increasing or decreasing the brush size. It does speed things up. This is a fully laminated screen, meaning there's no gap between the pen nib and the brush or line that you see on your screen. This was once a feature of more expensive tablets, but is now becoming the norm as prices drop too.
the pen was able to produce nice varied pen strokes depending on the pressure. Here's a tip, pressing the two middle keys for three seconds brings up the tablet's on-screen display menu. It's here you can change things like brightness, colour temperature and other display settings. The pen is nice and light and feels pretty comfortable to hold and draw with. It's battery free, supports 8192 levels of pressure sensitivity and supports 60 degrees of tilt, which basically means the harder you press the more varied the line will be produced and you can use it for producing like a shading effect. Think of it like shading with a pencil. We're back to normal speed now with this video, now you can watch me colour in with the brush tool.
this is another great tablet from Huion and comes thoroughly recommended. The keys feel nice when pressed and add to the overall positive user experience of this tablet. There, all finished. Whoops, forgot to colour in a bat here. I hate it when that happens. Well that's it for this review, don't forget to tell your friends, family and pets about this channel, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Oh, and don't forget to wash your hands.